What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal walkthrough, the 2022, maybe 2023 edition? I don't know. Who knows? It's probably a November edition. <laughs> I don't even know. Anywho, in our last episode, we went through Route 44, beat everybody, gave a little explanation, and now it is time for us to go straight into the Ice Path. This place right here, you can actually find some pretty rare Pokemon. I think one of them is Sneasel. And yes, I do have some super repels. There are no trainers here, so just, you know, you'll, you'll be cool. Now, the Pokemon I kind of want to check out is Sneasel. It is a Pokemon that, you know, I, I was thinking of actually capturing later on, but there it is. Okay, so let's see. Area. Yes, you can actually find Sneasel right here in the Ice Path. Was thinking of getting this Pokemon just because of its speed, its typing, and all that stuff. But, kind of thought against it because, well, I can always breed a Pokemon. So there we go, look at this. In Pokemon Crystal, you guys probably already noticed, the Ice Path is a little more vibrant. A little more highlighted and all that stuff. If you take a look at Pokemon Gold and Silver, it's like, uh, well, it's our initial game. They didn't want to put a little too much into it. Plus, it was, I, I think, I think it was like the second or third game for, like, the Nintendo uh, uh, Game Boy Color and all that stuff. And, well, let's go right here. Here we found the HM07, which is Waterfall. Let's go, let's, go, let's go ahead and see if this is correct. Yes, Waterfall. Now, there's just a messed up part about it. You have to win the final badge in order to actually use it. But, it is actually a good thing that we actually have this game or this, uh, this move because, well... It actually, it's going to be beneficial to us when we get to the the later stages of, uh, what was it called? Well, the, not the after game, but after defeating uh, Claire and all that crud. So let's see. Right here, there we go. Just not thinking about it. Now, if you're playing gold, uh, if you're playing the, if you guys are playing the remakes, there's going to be something special right here. I can't remember what it was. But make sure to have a Pokemon with strength because there are some potholes right there. And there, yeah, strength is going to be needed for this situation right here. So let's go right ahead and start moving all these boulders around. Okay, there we go. And believe it or not, guys, all these, like every single one of these boulders have to be moved. And, well, let's see, right here. There we go. And there's one. And the boulder fell through. Yes, sir. And, well, let's see. You gotta be very careful with these ones because if you pin it to a to a wall, you're gonna have to restart this whole thing. And it looks like to me, we have to push it all the way back. There we go. And there we go. Okay, so we got open space right there. And we're gonna go down right here. Another Pokemon you can actually find in this whole area is a is a Swinub. Swinub. Jinx, the Zubats and Golbats, you'll find them right here, and Sneasel, and, well, let's see, oh wow, that's, okay, yeah, that one's gonna be for this area right here, so, let's see, maximum effort, this is why I hate these puzzles, they're so annoying, and no matter how many times you play it, oh wow, <laughs> that was Siri, uh, hold on just a sec, guys. Okay, yeah. <laughs> if you guys don't know, I do like I do have two computers in my room. One for editing the videos and the other one just to record them and yeah, one of them is an Apple computer and you know, you know who if I say its name, it's going to turn on again and it's going to, you know, ask for some different commands and stuff that I don't need. So, let's go right ahead and push this right here. And we need to push it one last time to get it open. There we go. Follow as I do, guys. There we go. And bam. Okay, so that's three, I believe. Now, this one right here is a, is a difficult one. Okay, so if we press it up here. So, 
now you can actually go, let's see, go towards the open space right here. And this one, you're going to lead it all the way back up right here. That way you can actually move all the way around right here. Be careful for those potholes right there because you don't want to, uh, yeah, you don't want to fall into them. And let's see, now if you guys are ready for this next gym battle, this is a great place to actually get a, uh, a good leveled ice type Pokemon. So that's another one right there. And look at that. Boulders fell through. Now we are unable to go through this puzzle without any with it without any problems that and go straight to towards the items too that right there let's see I'm looking for items first and then after that I'm just gonna get to get the get, get at the end of the puzzle right here and there's nothing oh look at that we found ourselves a carbos which is also great and well let's see go right here 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 not there and our repel has worn out, so just make sure to bring a lot of repels too, guys, because there there are going to be some Pokemon that you don't you probably don't want to mess with. Uh, let's see, what if we go right here, here, and right here? Okay, so here, 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 and there. Okay, and there you go. Full heal has been attained, and let's go towards the final stage right here now. If you have Rock Smash on a Pokemon, you can actually go through this real quick. So, yes. Here it does have Rock Smash. And we grabbed ourselves a Nevermelt Ice. Unfortunately, we are full in our pack. So, let's see. I guess, we, I guess we're I guess we going to have to use a, a Carbos. Let's give it to... Let's give it to Serpentera, since, you know, it is our slowest Pokemon. And bam, we got ourselves a Nevermelt Ice. Powers up any kind of Ice-type moves. And, let's see, we have surpassed a bunch of things right here. And we're going up here. And I think this is the end. Could be wrong. We do want to get items first. And there's nothing right there. Okay, so, let's see. Hold on just a sec, right here. Going downstairs. And I believe it's right here. You'll be able to grab this item, and it's the TM44. TM44, let's see what it is. I think it's hail or something. Is there hail? TM44, nope, that's rest. Another good move. And let's see. Right here. Bam. And I think we got one or two more items to actually obtain. And it's this one right here. And we found ourselves an iron, which, you know... It's another great item to actually have, so let's go right ahead and take out something else. Hmm. We could use that max repel, but yeah, we kind of have a repel going. Let's give this smoke, this smoke ball right here to Serpentera. Grab this, found ourselves an iron. And let's give that iron to somebody else right here. Let's see. Iron, how's it going? And yeah, we're gonna give this to Togepi. Okay, so there we go. And our repel has worn off. So that right there enables us to actually use a max repel. So that gives us a little bit more space into our our bag. And we do have one more thing, I believe. And there we go. And we are at the very end of this whole thing right here. Look at that. Okay, so there are two things that you can actually grab here. Protein. And what else? If I'm not mistaken, maybe right here. Crap baskets. Okay, so I'm, I made a mistake. Oh, yeah, I could have just done that. And there we go. Found ourselves a PP up. And all we got to do now is go downstairs right here. And there you go, guys. We are now in Blackthorn City. And if you talk to this girl, it's like, wow, you came through Ice Path? You must be a real hotshot trainer. Yes, I am. Okay, alrighty, that was uh, that was very simple, very short, but still very simple and all that stuff. Whew. Okay, so there is quite a few things that need to be done before we get to our our final gym battle, and that is we gotta level up our Pokemon just a little bit because, well, let's see, let's see what we're looking at right here. 
Yeah, our Pokemon are, are at very good levels. The only problem is that we're not right there to compete against, uh, against Claire and all that stuff. So that's exactly what we're going to do. And the good thing is that we are in two different areas, or we're in an area where we can go to diff two different areas to actually train these Pokemon. So that is exactly what we're going to be doing, especially with the speed button. So just be aware of that. So stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, we will be going up against the gym leader, Claire. And, uh... Yeah, Tully Fisher is calling me. Okay, what a perfect day for fishing. We should get bottle. Yeah, that's not going to happen. I'm just going <laughs> to not do anything about it. So, yes, guys, we're going to be pausing right here. Stay tuned. In the next episode, we're going to be taking on Claire. If you guys want to make a small donation to this channel, link to the description. There's a heart button right there on the description right button right there, too. If you guys want to make a small donation. And, yes, if you guys want to catch exclusive videos... Uh, members only walkthroughs join the video right here or join the uh, channel right here and you'll be able to see some of these members only uh, walkthroughs thank you guys again for watching I will see you guys next time